here's my right. Okay. Oh, where's my right? <laughs> Cheers. Yeah, good one. Oh, Simon is here. I thought Simon oh, was busy. Uh, Hey Simon, tell us where we're going we're about today. To Jokoi, man, we're about to dab up Jokoi. Oh, we're about Jokoi. To kiss him. All right, let's ask him some questions. Yeah, I'm gonna ask him. Kiss me. Huh? Uh, let me think of a good question. Hey Jokoi. I don't know. I'll think about it. We're gonna go. I got my one question. What is it? Hey Jokoi, can you kiss me? What? We'll see. It's six feet apart still, or is it? Where is that? We're, we're going Oh, we're just following you. We don't know where it's Chinese, at. Chinese yeah. six. Keep going, keep going. You see outside the You see shiny, shiny shoes. There it is. There's Jokoi. Let's go. And whose clothes are these? Oh, these are uh, Joe Coy's shoes. How you doing, man? My camera. Very cool. I'm excellent. In a fast pace. It's it, this is before you were born. It's been a while. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. This is Sunday. It's your merch. It's your merch. <laughs> Two hours later. Filipino. <laughs> Mexican. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and as funny as that is, that was our reality. You know what I'm saying? Like she had to li really live through that reality. So for her to actually and me to actually see this happen now, it's just it's it's Unbelievable. So I really wanted to start with this question. How did you gather like all of the actors for this film? Like how did you, what was the thinking? Around That's that? the same process as any movie. It was, yeah. you know, the, these guys, it's Jay and it was, you know, and yo, you're not gonna believe this, but Steven Spielberg was a big part of the casting as yeah. well. Like he, yeah. that's another beautiful thing. Like we got the goat that was involved in this movie yeah. too. And when he said he was involved, he was really, Involved, and that was that was a beautiful thing. That he my Lolo told me that Lou Diamond Phillips was Filipino. I didn't know. Lolo was like, "Hey, he's Filipino. He is." And then my Lola said that Tia is Filipino. I'm like, "Oh, really?" I, 
How old were you? How old were you? Twelve. Twelve. I was twelve. Not feeling old at all. <laughs> <laughs> but okay, so we, we we don't use that word legend lightly. But you both have portrayed a wide range of characters in almost every film genre imaginable, but have rarely played Filipino characters. I remember reading never, this. Never. 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 So, okay, reading the, I remember reading the Esquire interview where you mentioned that you've only played a Filipino twice before this. And I had to write one of them. Yeah, in the, in the film Ambition, which I wrote, I wrote myself as, uh, you know, as a Filipino-American. Uh, uh, and, 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 but, you know, I was, I, I was trying to rep the Asian cred from way back. There just weren't any roles, you know? Yeah. And so when I was reading a breakdown on this film, and I saw a role that said Lou Diamond Phillips. I thought I might be able to play. <laughs> <laughs> so did Jimmy. I auditioned for your role. Jimmy and I played Lou just like Lou. I auditioned too. I know. See. first met you, Joe? For you sure. reminded me. I love it. I met Joe behind the front desk of a motel in Las Not Vegas. Not motel. Oh, <laughs> I just thought... Tia came in like, I need crack. And I'm like, <laughs> 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 oh, come on. No, but you said that. It was a nice hotel. You said you were in the front desk. Wow. And, and, and I was like checking 20... in with my mom. Yeah, it's your mom. And I was doing a, a pilot there. Yeah. And I said, oh, I'm sorry, I'm late. I'm t checking in. He said, you're Tia. I said, I'm Tia Carrere. And he goes, oh, yeah. You didn't say that I said that to oh, you. Oh, you said that to me. <laughs> Do you want me to tell you your tell story? You <laughs> well, you're the one that told me the story when you were opening for Love It's that Yeah, day. but because, well, you're telling it wrong. Okay. So yeah, don't tell it to me. But, 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 one more. There's one more that like like blew me out of the water. Okay, and it's a full circle thing. It's I was on a date and I was watching Hook, right? <laughs> I was watching Hook. I was watching Hook like this. You gotta remember, Hook was huge. It was like Dustin Hoffman, Robin, Robin Williams, Julia Roberts. Like the the promotion was just a hook. It was a show because everyone knew that this was gonna be the blockbuster. This is gonna be the movie. And I remember watching. I had my popcorn. I was on a date. And then Rufio walked out. I was like, Rufio! Yeah. Yeah. And, and this is what I said. This is what I said. I go, back to Filipino. Oh, and I'm not dating. I know, I know, I know. I know, I know, I know. I know. I know. That's what I'm getting at. That's what I'm getting at. Rufio! I see it. I see him. And I'm like, that looks like my cousin. And I couldn't even concentrate on the movie. I couldn't even concentrate on the movie. I let those. I, I watched the whole movie until the end, and I, I waited till those those credits ran, and I saw Bosco, and they go, "I told you." I told you. So this is right here. I've known Joe for a while in the stand-up comedy scene. Yeah. You, you know what's funny? I was watching this Kevin Hart interview with Chris Rock, and Kevin was like, dude, you were the one that put your arm around me. It was like, yo, welcome to the world. And that was Joe. Joe was always my big brother in the stand-up comedy world, and he like welcomed me. Heart broken, because you know? we that journey we started together, oh, man, and then yeah. COVID broke us up because Netflix, you know, the, the, your space thing, whatever it's called. Yeah, the whole thing. My space thing. It's a show called Space Force. No, it's not. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. The show almost took you away from it us. Did, cause, cause, and that's why I say it like that. Well, this, I, this was a dream come true. And, and, and this movie, when I see it, it's like, you know, finally, like, our voices are being heard. And not just Filipinos, just everyone. Like, this is that chance that, that, that's been offered. And it's like, when I look at it, I'm not, I'm not looking at me. I'm looking at everybody, man. You know what I mean? All of us. We're all in here, and that's us. You know what I mean? We're all gonna have an opening night <laughs> at this theater right here, and, and we're we're gonna be in 3,200 theaters across the country. And we're gonna be. We're gonna go and I'm not just saying Filipinos in general. I'm saying everybody. We all get to say our story, and when you watch that story, you're all gonna go, "Hey, we're the same." <laughs> My mom is just like you. 
That's it. That's all I have to say. So what do you guys think? It was cool, huh? Yeah, Spider-Man? I didn't get to ask my question. Oh, yeah, yeah. They didn't even ask for anybody for any question, right? Yeah, what happened to the Q&A? Yeah, it was just A and A and A. Yeah, it was A and A. A and A. <laughs> no Q's. Oh, I know. <laughs> no Q's, only A's. By the way, why are we in a hurry? They need to go to Yashimura. We had a reservation, but we're pretty late. Oh, we're in Hollywood. Oh, who's in here, Sean? That's a Iron Man cat, four, director, Wanda Vision. Who did you find? Warren. Warren Beatty. Who has bigger hands, you or um, Captain America? We have the same hands. I have the hands of America. Oh, almost. <laughs> Let's try to find uh, where I could put my shoes here. Whose shoe could I fit? Um, oh, Matt Damon. Okay. I know Matt Damon. Oh. Oh, if the shoe fits. There you go. I'm the same size with Matt Damon. Hey guys, I found my my uh, perfect Cinderella fit. You know who my fit is in the shoe? Okay, come. All right, check this out. Me and this guy are the same guy. Matt Damon. Ah, oh, see? Will Smith. Me and him are the same. Why did I get the middle one and they were old? Let's see. Me and Will Smith. Are you and Will Smith? I think I'm more Matt Damon than you are. No. Oh, oh my goodness. You said more, I Matt think Damon I'm more Chris, Chris Rock got slapped by this hair. Oh, which hand? This one. Oh, Keep my wife's name! That's the, that's that's the, the hand that slapped his face. Chris Rock. Are he, he? All because of alopecia. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> my goodness. Slap. Who slapped who? Where? Let's go. I'm gonna follow you. Nope. It's Hollywood. Nope. Dick. What'd you say, boy? Dick Powell. Is that Quentin Tarantino? Oh. Do a flip! Do a flip! Do a flip! When it, do you know that I attended two star um, presentation here in Hollywood when I was younger? Okay. Guess who? Oh, you won't guess. Uh, E.T. I attended Tom Cruise when they gave him a star uh -huh. and Janet Jackson. Did 
they um, invite you? Or you no. Just crash a party. You just <laughs> you just get in line. <laughs> you just stand. You don't get in line. You just stand. Yeah. That was a long. I skipped school so, for Tom Cruise. Do you like the Hollywood stars? Do you like it? Um. Yeah. 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 Are you into Hollywood? <laughs> Uh, not really. How did you like Joko then? Oh, Joko is good. Yeah. Me and Sean are looking for what star? Tia Correa. Lou? Lou Diamond Phillips. Oh, Lou Phillips, yeah. Lou yeah. Diamond Phillips. I, I know he has the star. Yeah, I know he has the star. Because he's up there, right? Yeah. Right, Lou? Yeah.